Firstly, it still fucking mind fucks me to this day. How so many people come up to me, meet me, see me in person, they have a chat to me, they talk to me in person, I, I speak openly to them, I speak honestly to them. And you know what? These guys are all shocked, man. They turn to their mates, they look at their mates, and I hear the whispers, I hear what they say. Fuck. This chest fry guy's alright, man. He's actually got a personality, he's actually got a he's actually got brain in his fucking head. He, you know, he's got a good head on his shoulders, he knows how to talk, he knows how to express himself. He's not he's not just an idiot. And you know what? It's fucking it's heartbreaking hearing that shit because I do have this reputation of being a fucking of being a dumb cunt and being just a, just an idiot who doesn't know how to like express himself or talk. And that's what I'm here doing, man. I'm here to prove all the haters wrong, man. I've got a personality. I've got an education. I've got a university degree which I studied three years. I've got a major in business operations management logistics. As went to high school, as was ducks of year seven to year twelve. I was top of my grades. I got 86 out of 100 for my UAI answer score. I made it, man. I did what I wanted to do, man. I wanted to be a good soccer player when I was younger. I did it. I wanted to be a good skateboarder. Despite my parents and everyone telling me not to, I still did it. And then you know what? And then gym came into my life. People told me I couldn't train. People told me I couldn't do this. People told me I'm always going to stay skinny. And you know what? I showed these motherfuckers. I showed them. I fucking left school. You know what I did? All those friends that were making fun of me, I stopped answering their calls. I stopped talking to them. I went straight into fit- Fitness First Carlingford, Sydney. This was about two th- I can't 2008, 2007, something like that. I signed up to a gym membership. I walked in, naive, young. I didn't know what was going on, but I knew one thing. I'm here to make a difference. I'm here to prove all the haters wrong. I'm here to train for myself, and I'm here to make something on myself. And that's what I did. I started training. I started going gym. I started eating. My lifestyle changed. I stopped drinking every weekend, getting plastered and drunk on the... Thinking it's fucking... You're a sick cunt by getting smashed and picking up girls. I stopped doing all that shit. You know what I mean? I stopped going out clubbing all the time. And I started going to the gym Monday to Saturday. Training five, six days a week. Six meals a day, everything. Getting eight hours of sleep a night. My multivitamins. All my fucking training, everything. Why? Because I wanted to better myself. Not just physically, but mentally. Because when you're physically strong, you're mentally strong. It makes you mentally stronger up here. Because when you're strong up here, you can do anything, anything you want in life. People tell you you can't do something in life, don't listen to them. You go ahead, you turn around, you say okay, and you come back later on and you fucking show them ten times as bad as they would have thought. You show them what you fucking did with your life. Whether it might be fucking gym, money, your job, family, anything. You turn around and you prove all these haters wrong. And that's what I'm here to do, guys. I'm here to, like, I'm here to turn all the guys around that hate me for no reason. I'm here to set back straight. I'm here to tell you guys the reasons for my actions. Even though some of you may not see it. Even though some of you may not see why I do the things I do. I speak from the bottom of my heart. And I speak sincerely when I say everything I do is straight from the bottom of my heart. And always with good intentions. Always. Even if it doesn't look like it. I swear on my brother's grave, everything I do is always with good intention. And I just hope some of you haters can see that. Because deep down, I'm just a normal guy like you guys. That's all I am. And you know what? We're all in this together. We're here to train, we're here to inspire each other, we're here to motivate each other. So let's put all bullshit aside for a second and form an army. No one is out there like us. We're, we're strong-minded people. We're, we're, we're powerful, you know, we're good at what we do. And let's use that knowledge to better ourselves and better our love for the sport, for our sport of body. That was epic. But, <laughs> Mara and I, I hope someone recorded that. I'll fucking make some Oh, shit.